three. Hey, Yellow Jackets. My name is Kensington. I'm here with Alayla, Ava, and Carla. Today, we are going to be interviewing about building healthy digital habits. Okay, guys. So, how do you use digital devices? I use social media platforms to keep myself entertained. I don't like that people can track you down by using air tags. Um, I use digital devices for watching Netflix, YouTube, and Disney Plus. Um, I use digital devices to keep me entertained and chat with people. That's cool. I use digital devices to connect with my friends and to watch Netflix. What do y'all like or dislike about digital devices? I personally, I dislike that people on social media make their lives like look perfect. And then like sometimes you can get insecure about yours. Um, I don't like that people can be really mean sometimes on social media, and it sometimes makes me feel bad about myself. Um, I don't like that people, like, can, like, they track what they do, and they don't really act like themselves sometimes, because, yeah. um, yeah. I, I don't like, I just like social I just like some parts of social media because they make their lives very, like, perfect when it really isn't. Yeah. And how does that make you feel? Weird. because <laughs> It makes me feel weird because, like, just be yourself on yeah. there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What concerns you about how much time you spend using digital devices or screen time in general personally what concerns me is that like if i'm spending too much time it just takes me away from spending time with my family or my friends because i'm so distracted by social media yeah i agree it just takes time of the w of the stuff that matters the most um, yeah, so the same thing because sometimes if you just keep watching something or you keep doing something on your phone, you just don't spend mi much time with your family and stuff, so it can create a distance. Yeah. Yeah. It concerns me how much I use my phone because it'd be 5 o'clock, and then I look back at the time, and it's 8 o'clock. Yes. Yes, like wasting time. Yeah, like yeah. this morning, I woke up at like 4 <laughs> and I was I just went on my phone and it was like six so I was like went back to bed and I only had like twenty more minutes to sleep and I was yeah. like so tired. Okay, but do you worry about what you do online or how you use technology? Can y'all give an example or tell a story about device about how somebody used a device and it affected them? Well. I, this has never happened to me, or, like, I can't tell the time that it has happened, but I know there's people out there that will, like, call you and ask for your personal information, and they will lie about who they are so you can give it to them, but they're just trying to scam you. Yeah. Um, okay, so there was this one time, um, I, okay, so I, I, I woke up, and um. I'm using my phone. I turn around and I look back at my phone and and I wasn't using it. It was weird. So like, <laughs> uh, were you having like a dream or deja vu? Like, I, no, <laughs> I wasn't. <laughs> no, I, it was just my imagination. I, I was like, since I'm like so, I think it's because of how much time I spend on my phone. Yeah, it, you're like yeah. like. like you're just yeah. used to being <laughs> yeah. on it all the time. I don't. I don't know. Daydreamy. Yeah. <laughs> Um, well, I worry that I would get hacked if someone, like, messages me and pretends to be someone I know. Because a few days ago, a girl that I know, like, personally messaged me and said, I made this a few days ago. I hope you like it. And 
there was a link. Yes, I clicked it. That was a dumb move, but it told me to put in my password. I trusted my in instinct, and I didn't. So I could have got hacked, and that would have been really bad. And now we're going to end part one. You can come in tomorrow, and I'll show you how to put the...